Hey YouTube, it's Dan for Default and Heat. Um, today's sort of a tutorial on how to do gun effects. So yeah, um, over here I got my modified Nerf Maverick. The, um, so yeah, um, yeah, I've taken that off and some stuff. So, yeah. so what you need is the an app called Gun Movie Gun Movie Effects. It's on the App Store on your iPod and stuff for like a dollar. So don't worry, it doesn't cost much. So what you do is you take a film of you shooting a gun like like that but I'm not going to put the effects in for that one so this one I'm going to put the effects in and what you can do is you can actually put the gun shot and some blood like you can shoot at the screen like this and there will be blood on the screen for the, basically the whole movie okay so yeah I, I will first show you what it looks like and then I will go on my laptop and then film or maybe I should just yeah I'll just film through my iPod since it's jailbroken and get stuff. So. See, I'm back. Um, you need to take a video, but I couldn't take a video while I was recording. See, so, yeah. what you would want to do is you want it would start off with this, this one right here. You can choose to make it a big flame, a small flame, or rotate it anyway. See, so, yeah. that's what you do. And if you want to change it, click on that. I'll just got all these ones. And make sure this noises, but you can't you probably can't hear it. And it's got the sh red blood, bl red blood squirt. You can choose from where, it, from where it, like, so you would shoot there, about there. And I want the blood to come up around there. And when that sh does that, what you want to do is quickly go down and click blood splat sound. I mean, it doesn't sound good but it's actually pretty it's okay then there's a trigger click sound when you like shoot a gun and it doesn't have any bullets throughout and then there's a reload sound it sounds like that you probably can't hear it but like it actually sounds like a gun reloading so yeah when you're done with that you click the tick button it will just process after a while like it'll just process and stuff see it'll say building movie and some if you've got a long video, it'll take a long time. If you don't, it won't take that long. See, so mine only took a couple of seconds. Now watch this. That's the effects of the video. Now to save it to your camera roll, you click on this button right down there. So you click on that, and that'll happen. You'll have to if it's a long video, it's going to take a while. So yeah, um. That's about it, and um, I was just mainly doing this video if you guys want to make some, like, random shooting arms videos without using all these expensive programs that cost like $100, some shit. Um, so yeah, if you want to, you can do all this crap, you can go back to your home screen. If you didn't save it, you can, if you can, yeah, if you didn't save it, you can review gallery, and you'll have all these. Um, this is my cousin doing this one. This one's sort of fucked up. See, that was only practice. Then we got this one right there. See, you can do it with anything. And then, see, over here. And then there's the same one but with a click at the end. And what you want to do is with the, when you take the, when you put down the thing, only do it once. Do not do it more than once or it will actually sound like at the same, it would actually do the thing at the same time, just repeating. So it's that up right down there. Thanks for watching and see you guys later.